what's up my loves and welcome to or back to my channel it's your girl christy renee here back at it again with another video for you guys y'all i am super excited today i have a new fragrance for you guys so i got my hands on the new ariana grande cloud pink if you guys are not new to my channel then you know that Ariana Grande Cloud, the original, is one of my absolute faves. I love that scent so freaking much. It smells so good. The perfect blend of like cotton candy and marshmallows. So when I saw that this was coming out, I had to have it. So we are going to get into this today. It just came in the mail today. Have not opened it. I know I'm a little late. Okay, I ordered it like maybe three or four days after it released okay so mine is just now getting here this fragrance only comes in one size which is a hundred milliliter bottle and it retails for $68 I think that that's a good price point for this fragrance um a lot of 100 milliliter bottles are usually over a hundred dollars so for this to be $68 is very good so the box is basically the same as the original except for it's pink and you have Ariana Grande on the back of it which is super cute so let's go ahead and get this bad boy bust open okay I don't know why my box smell like that my box smells very weird it smells like a lot of chemicals i don't like that so i don't want to sniff it too much because i don't know what that's all about okay so here is the bottle a very huge bottle like this bottle is big here it is in comparison to my original cloud uh this one i believe is like the one point something fluid ounce bottle i can't remember what size this one is but yeah, so this is the size different. Also came with a free gift because I ordered mine off Ulta. I don't know if you can get it anywhere else, but I got mine off Ulta because that's where I saw it at. And mine came with some playing cards from her. I don't play cards, so I probably will be gifting this to someone. Christmas is right around the corner. So if you're watching this video and you see this in your gift bag, then. I love you too. Let's go ahead and get into the fragrance notes of this fragrance. I have not watched any reviews on this fragrance. I have not blind smelt this. This was a straight up blind buy. I did not watch any reviews. Like I said, I just know how much I like the original cloud. So I was like, okay, let me just go ahead and get this one right here because I'm sure that I will like it just as much as I like the original. So I'm going to go ahead and get into the fragrance notes. So the top notes are Pattaya. I hope I said that right p-i-t-a-h-a-y-a -A -A. <laughs> wild berries pineapple coconut water vanilla orchid ambrette praline musk moss and amber wood make sure I don't have anything on me because I do want to do a skin test the bottle super cute super simple just like the original gorgeous okay so this one smells a lot like the original i just get a more sweeter more barrier scent from this one it smells like more berries it smells very pink if that makes any sense like almost like a pink sugar type of vibe going on with this y'all this smells really good i'm kind of Girl, hold up. Let me see something. Let me spray this one right here on the back of my hand. Okay, so yeah, this one right here is giving a lot of cotton candy. A lot of like marshmallow fluff. But this one is giving super sweet pink sugars with a lot. Like a bucket full of berries with pink sugar in it. Y'all, this one smells really good. I'm going to have to say, this one is kind of sort of more caramelized than this one. This one is more sugary, and this one is more like a caramel, syrupy almost vibe to it. I don't know if it's because this bottle is getting a little bit old or what, because y'all already see, girl, your girl ain't got nothing left in that bottle, but your girl's still spraying. But yes, there's definitely a difference in, in these two scents. You're not going to get the same fragrance, so if you were thinking about getting Ariana Grande Cloud Pink, 
and you were wondering if it smells anything like the original it does on first sniff i did get a lot of the original when i first sprayed it but as it as it's sitting on my skin i'm getting a lot of like sugary marshmallows and berries there's definitely a huge difference in these scents but if you like the original then you are going to love this one because i now y'all already know this is my first impression y'all just seen me unbox this on the camera with y'all so this is straight raw uncut i'm gonna have to wear it and give you guys an update on it later on down the road well right now you heard it here first this one is killing the original okay it's killing it it does not stand a chance in the ring with that one i am in love with this okay and i know y'all like girl you just sprayed it but i can't get enough of this and i don't know if it's just my body chemistry but this thing is really doing it for me okay definitely the sweet berries for me i definitely give this fragrance a 10 out of 10 it's not much more that i can say and also you guys i got some free samples with my sephora order because y'all already know i had to buy me some new foundation so i got the i'm gonna just throw this in there just because i got it and i thought that it was a really nice scent so they sent over a sample of the Skylar Peach Fields. So I'm going to go ahead and review this one for you guys. I already sprayed it earlier today. Y'all, this one smells amazing. If you like the scent Peach and you like really perfumey fragrances, then this is definitely for you. This is very potent. When you first spray it for like the first, I would say about 20, 25 minutes, it's so freaking strong. Be really light when you spray this because it smells like a super perfumey peach fragrance. It's sweet like a peach, but it also gives that very perfume. Like it doesn't give body spray at all. It's very strong, it's very potent, and it smells very good. So I would highly recommend this. And this one is white peach osmantis and sandalwood y'all already know how i feel about my sandalwood anything with sandalwood in it i'm nine times out of ten gonna like it that's just something that i have noticed about myself so take that however you want to take it okay so this one is juicy lush flirty and yeah it smells super good but i just wanted to throw that in there it has nothing to do with this video so if you made it this far and you saw that let me know if you guys have tried any of the skylar fragrances let me know the longevity on them and are they worth the money because i have never bought a skylar fragrance but i seen that they had a vanilla fragrance that i really wanted to get my hands on so i think i'm going to go ahead and do that but yeah back to the star of the show ariana grande cloud pink is definitely a showstopper for me i will definitely be keeping this in my collection and i will probably be buying another bottle by the middle of next year or something because yes okay so the scent is starting to like really come down now and it's really giving marshmallows. It's giving marshmallows, but the berries are still there. But that marshmallow is really overpowering. That pink sugar type of vibe. But it doesn't smell anything like the pink sugar. It just gives that vibe. So I don't want you guys to get confused with anything that I'm saying. Because that's not what it is. This is definitely a girly girl scent. If you do not like super sweet gourmand scents, then this is not for you. But yes, that's my thought on the new Ariana Grande pink. You know, you guys, in the comment section down below, do you guys plan on buying this fragrance? And if so, let me know your thoughts on it. If you do have it or if you're going to get it. I thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Please give this video a thumbs up. And do not forget to subscribe to my channel. And what? Turn on post notifications so that you guys can know when I post. I love you guys so much. And I will see you in my next video.